Hey gang, welcome back. Today we're going to test the initial sharpness of the Kuma 8-inch chef knife and the Kangshen V2 8-inch chef knife. Again, these are both 8-inch chef knife. Uh, they are um, similar form factor. I think there's a little bit of a difference. The, the Kuma is made of, um, uh, you know, 3CR13 steel, whereas the um, Kang Shen is made of the X50 CR MOV15 uh, steel, um, both of which have the reputation for being able to take a, a very sharp edge. Now, there's a little bit of a difference in terms of the um, overall fit and finish. The Kang Shen has a definite edge uh, with a distinctive um, uh, form factor. Again, the, uh, the bolster, as you can see, is, is kind of uh, slanted. And I'm not sure if I love this or if I hate it uh, yet. Uh, but what I do know uh, is we'll be putting through, well, this through its paces over the next uh, week, week and a half here in our um, test facility, which is just my, my tabletop. Um, well, let's look at the uh, Kuma knife first. And I thought that it would be appropriate uh, to start slicing away through the ever-present, um, oh, what is this? This is a credit card offer. Uh, that I get plenty of in the mail. Let's just see how um, this can take on the task of ripping it up. Well, that feels great. And I want to reiterate how light the Kuma uh, feels. It really does feel light in the hand. Yeah, it's, it's nice. I could, I could do this all day because I'm the, you know, type of nerd that likes to cut through, cut through paper. Oh, it's, a, it's a fantastic blade. Uh, Kuma is, you know, for the price point, I think very, very difficult to beat. Um, now I say very difficult to beat because we have a, another contender uh, here. We have the Kangshen V2. Uh, and again, we're going to use the, uh, uh, the back side of the same uh, uh, credit card advertisement and see how it, uh, how it does. This is initial out-of-the-box sharpness. Oh, you can just... I mean, this is, it glides effortlessly through this paper. Sorry about this, uh, Citibank, but you will not be getting my patronage. Fantastic. Uh, again, I could do this all day. Uh, total knife geek. We will be putting these knives through their paces over the next week here in our test facility. And um, we'll report back as to which one holds up better over long-term use. We'll give each of these a sharpen on our sharpening stone and see if they can uh, get this uh, razor-sharp edge that we find out of the box uh, back. In any case, have a good one.